Many officials and parents are excited about the new additions. That's right, AJ. Now, this is the fifth renovation the district has done in the last eight years. Our Kyle Willis sat down with the superintendent and has more on how they're looking to improve education. It's been very exciting for, for myself, for the district, the staff, and the entire community to see the transformation in each of these buildings. I'm constantly asked, which one's next? Which one's next? Because we've been very fortunate to completely change the image of the district. Jacksonville Superintendent Steve Potosik says renovations at Eisenhower Elementary School began last June as a way to revamp the school while still keeping the integrity of the historical building. Last year, Washington Elementary School got a new look as well, making this the fourth elementary school that has been remodeled in the district. Our buildings were old. This, this was one of our newest facilities uh, that was built in 1972. Our buildings definitely were in, this, were, were in the condition that they needed substantial repair. Potosik says the school was originally built as an open concept with hardly any windows, saying this new renovation not only will give teachers actual classrooms, but the kids will be able to see the outside world while learning. We've added in a new cafeteria because this space right here, the gym, was shared as the cafeteria for the last 50 years. So now we have a separate cafeteria, so it's just overall going to be an amazing transformation for this facility. There will also be enhanced security measures added to the school to keep students more safe while learning. Eisenhower Principal Tim Chipman says he is excited to be around for the progress. This is a feather in the cap of the town. It's, it's something that we should all embrace and be proud of. And I simply can't wait to welcome folks from not just Jacksonville, but around the region into this new 21st century state of the art school. Parents I spoke to say they are glad the district is working to remodel their schools, saying it's important for kids to learn in an updated environment. It's just really nice to have something new, something fresh and new. Thank you, Kyra. Now, the renovations at Eisenhower Elementary cost the district about $13 million and are expected to be finished by this spring. Yeah, the superintendent says the five remodels cost the district about $75 million over the last few years, and they're using the sales tax to complete these renovations. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.